Hello everyone, welcome to Career Tricks YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to learn about divisibility trick for seven. There are three methods are there for divisibility trick for seven. We are covering all the three methods in this video. If you are visiting first time to my channel, please click on subscribe button. For more notification, please click on bell icon. We'll move on to the first problem now. Before moving to the first problem, we have to know that what is the pattern we are going to use for uh, checking the divisibility for 7. Here, this is the first method. What we are going to do here is in this first method, uh, we are going to remember this pattern. How to remember this pattern, I will let you know. There is a very easiest trick is there. We have to write a series of number like 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, sequence. This sequence we have to write in a row. 1, 2, 3. First digit we have to take it as negative sign. Next three digit we have to take it as positive sign. After that next three digit we have to take negative sign. After that next three digit positive. If they give any number of digits, you can easily find out that usable by 7 or not by remembering this pattern. First we will solve the first problem now. That is 4, 6, 1, 6, 1, 5. I will apply this pattern to this numbers now. That is minus 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 1 minus 2 minus 3. After multiplying these two terms, what we will get? 4 into minus 1, that is minus 4, 6 into plus 2, that is plus 12. 3 into 1 that is plus 3, 6 into 1 that is plus 6, 1 into minus 2 that is minus 2, 5 into minus 3 that is minus 15. After that we have to add these numbers minus 4 plus 12 what we will get 8, 8 plus 3 we will get 11, 11 plus 6 we will get 17, 17 minus 2 we will get 15, plus 15 we are having here minus 15 plus 15 will be cancelled and will get 0. For this problem we are getting 0 answer after solving in this method. If you get 0 or any number it will be divisible by 7 then we can say this number also will be divisible by 7. Similar way we will solve this second problem that is 1, 6, 5, 1, 7, 9. I will apply the pattern now that is minus 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 1 minus 2 minus 3. After that I will multiply these two terms. What is the answer we'll get? That is minus 1 into 1 minus 1. 6 into 2 that is plus 12. 5 into 3 plus 15. 1 into 1 plus 1. 7 into minus 2 that is minus 14. 9 into minus 3 that is minus 27. After that we will add these two terms we will get 11. 11 plus 15 we will get 26. 26 plus 1 we will get 27. Plus 27 we got plus 27 minus 27 will cancel remaining is minus 14. Minus 14 will neglect this sign and we will check this 14 is divisible by 7 or not. That is divisible by 7, 7 twos are 14, then definitely this number will be divisible by 7. This is the first method uh, we using pattern we are going to solve this. We have to remember this pattern minus 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 1 minus 2 minus 3 minus 1. N number of uh, digits are there also we can solve using this pattern. We will move on to the second method now. Divisibility trick for method 2. What is the method 2 will do? Unit digit of number multiplied by 2. What is the unit digit in this? 6 is the unit digit. We will multiply it by 2. After that, what is the answer we will get? That will be subtracted by the remaining digit. Remaining digit means I will split into two parts. This is a unit digit. These are the remaining digits. What are the answer will come 6 into 2 that is 12. I will subtract it by the remaining digit 4, 5, 2, 0. 12 will be subtracted by this remaining digit, what will be the answer? 8, 0, 5, 4. After that, again I will take the unit digit. Unit digit is 8. I will multiply by 2. 
450 is there this side. What is the answer? 8 to the 16. 16 will be subtracted by 450. What will get? That is 4, 3, 4 will get. Again, 43, 4, 3, 4 is there. 4, 3, 4. Unit digit is 4 will multiply by 2. That is 8 will be the answer. The remaining digits are 4, 3. I will subtract 8 by 43. That time will get 35. 35 is divisible by 7. Yes, it is divisible by 7. Then definitely this number will be divisible by 7. And we will solve the next problem now. What is the first thing we have to do? We have to multiply by 2 to the unit digit. And what is the answer we will get? That answer we will subtract by the remaining digits. 7 to the 14. 14 will be subtracted with 1722. That time what will get? 8, 8, 0, 7, 1 will get. After that, again we will check the unit digit. Unit digit is 8 into 2. Multiplying these two terms will get 16. 16 will be subtracted by the remaining digits. That is 170. 170 minus 16 is 4, 5, 1. After that, unit digit is 4. I will multiply by 2. That is 4 twos are 8. Remaining digits are 15. I will subtract 15 minus 8. I will get 7. 7 is divisible by 7. S. Then this number also will be divisible by 7. This is the second method. This is the easiest method. And we will go to the third method now. In this second method, what we are doing? We are doing you taking the unit digit and multiply by 2. After multiplying by 2, what is the answer we will get? That answer will subtract by the remaining digits. Come to the third method. In the third method, what we are doing? In the third method, unit digit of number multiply by 5 and add the remaining, add to that remaining digits. Means the same method, previous method, what we subtracted, we here we are adding. And multiplication of 2 is there in the previous method here, multiplication of 5. I will take the unit digit is 6, I will multiply by 5. After that, I will get 30 answer. The 30 will be added to the remaining digits. That is 4, 5, 2, 0. I will add with 30. Then 0, 5, 5, 4 will get. Once we get this, unit digit is 0 is there. Unit digit 0 means we will neglect that. We will take only 455. Next step, we will take 455. And unit digit is 5. I will multiply with 5. Then 25 will get. 25 will be added to the remaining digits. That is 45. If I add 25 to this, what will get? 0, 1 carry, that is 70 will get. 70 is divisible by 7. Yes, 10 right is 70. Then this number will be divisible by 7. We will solve the second problem now. Unit digit is 5. 5 into 5, 25 will get. We will add to the remaining digits, that is 2, 5, 5, 1. Plus 25 will do. That time 6, 7, 5, 7, 5, 2 will get. Then again, unit digit is 6. We will multiply by 5. That is 30 will get. 30 will be added to the 257. 30 will be added to this. That time what will get? That is 287 will get. Unit digit is 7. Multiply by 5. 35 will get. The 35 will be added to 28. After adding this, we will get 63. Okay. 63 will get. 63 is divisible by 7. Yes, it is divisible by 7. 7 ones are 7 nines. Are. Then this number also will be divisible by 7. Here, this is a very simple trick. There are three methods we covered in this video. Any of the method, whichever is easier for you, that method you choose and you solve the divisibility method for 7. Whenever the digits are more, that time you will choose the first method. Whenever digits are less, you can choose any of second and third method, whichever you are comfortable with. If you like this video, please click on like and subscribe button. For more notification, click on bell icon. Thank you.